Coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. Here he is, the decorated kickboxer, back for more here tonight. And he's so comfortable in the striking realm. It's almost like he started kickboxing before he ever was reading or writing. Oh, it's unbelievable to see someone that's so comfortable under so much duress. I know. When you're in kickboxing range, you are in the fire. There is no safety. You're right in range to be getting knocked out. But he does not fear that. He loves it. He loves the, com he loves the combat. He loves the engagement. But what you have to understand is he's not engaging his opponents on their terms. He's doing it on his terms. Whether or not he wants to be in close with the big punches or he wants to be at range landing kicks, he's just constantly putting damage on you. Top, bottom, up, low, it does not matter. This guy is a dominant striker, one of the best kickboxers the UFC has ever seen. And in terms of the punching technique and the jab, as good as anyone in this division. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 168 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, grip the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back your corners, can I fight? When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Separate. 
big call from Punch Land. Now he gets back to range. Checks the leg kick. Oh, man, hate to be hit with one of those knees to the body. Look at how he turned his hip into that leg kick. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Just over three minutes to go round one. Let him go. Time to let those I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. It's such a fast leg kick. Now connects with the right. Under three minutes remain in round one. Cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, he missed with that right hand. <laughs> Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Punches and punches. Punches and punches. Let's go. strike there as he lands up top and he does so right after catching the leg so maybe you thought he would catch the leg and go for a takedown instead he goes for the punch and he certainly found the range on that one. Oh. oh big left hook there under two minutes to go in a back and forth first round here under two minutes in the first round Oh, Strong defense there to block the shot. Oh, collar tie. 90 seconds remain in the round. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Pretty good right hand. And that one certainly found the target. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Throws the right hand there. Oh, big head kick there. And that one was heavy. Straight right. Keep the pressure on. Everything's landing. So we cross the 30-second mark in our opening round. And he landed the right hand there. 15 seconds remain in the round. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. 10 seconds now to go in the round. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Five minutes in the books. All right, well, that was a crazy round. I don't know if we should laud the chin of his opponent or give him the credit for landing head kick after head kick. When the head kicks land this often on the video game, it's because player one understands the game much better than player two. Tell your friend how to play the game, teach him how to block, or teach him how to throw the head kick too. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kick. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Big leg kick land. Oh, caught him with a head kick. That at least partially landed. Oh my goodness, he got kicked in the head and he's still standing. I want to see the high kick. Lee 
Going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. Big kick land. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, oh. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Nice body kick. Oh, nice knee to the body. Very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Oh, nice slip there. It sounds simple, right? Hit and that is as good a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. the punch nicely there. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Nice hook. Out of range with that one. Right hand on point. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Ooh, and he caught the kick. Switching stances here. Big kick lands. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. He blocked the punch. That one snuck in. Nice strike. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. One more takedown. Just unable to quite find that range. attempt but unable to land. Punch over the top. Oh, you gotta <laughs> like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. There's no tell on that leg kick. <laughs> Lee gets caught by that straight punch there. 20 seconds to go. We need that take down. 15 seconds. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. That right hand hurt him a little bit. 10 minutes in the books. All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. Nobody's not come down like that before. 
All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? Go, guys, Both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high level of exposure. And he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Massive head kick. Landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. They continue to exchange. Checks that leg kick. Ooh, big shot lands. Right under the table. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Oh, beautiful execution with the knee strike there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a beautiful strike like that knee with? We'll see very shortly. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Great punch landed with so much power. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Trying to kick the leg out. Superman punch. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. And both guys really throwing with authority. Big kick lands. Liver kick. Plus right hand is true. And he switches his stance yet again. See, you don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh! Huge kick to the head. Now, there's danger in that, too, because when you start reaching down to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. Take it down. Oh, nice knee to the body. Strong to quite strong there. Nice sneaky hit kick. Look at the turnover in that kick. Watch knees to the body. Just out of range with that right hand. 15 seconds. Sneaky head kick. Beautiful strike. 
just misses with the left hook. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, the round is over. Gut check time for him now. You see the cut on his cheek has gotten really, really bad. And even though it's not affecting his vision, if it gets any worse, the doctor will be called in. And I can assure you, he's going to have no choice but to stop this fight. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat. Both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to log the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10 plus minutes of fight. in the night. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Just misses with that one. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Hands high, hands high. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Nice punch lands over the top. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Visibly limping here. There's no give on that leg kick. Kick attempt here, it's no good. Big head kick lands. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Well, some fighters, when they get cracked in the mouth, they respond well. He got stunned earlier in the round and hasn't really recovered or gotten back into things. People react differently, right? Some people just get back going. He's having a hard time building his way back into this punch. Left hand punch with the clinch. Oh, well done to block that powerful kick to the body. What a punch. There's that head kick. Ninety seconds now to go in this one. Wow. Blocks the shot. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Nice straight punch. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, he landed that knee to the midsection. Got to think his opponent's going to feel that. Right. And he's going to continue to throw that strike because he knows that his opponent can't take many of them.
Lee gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. 30 seconds to go now. Big body kick Lee. Great punch. Fifteen seconds to go. Nice kick. <laughs> Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, beautiful strike attempt there as he lands the hook. Beautiful hook. Really did a great job of keeping his back hand on his chin, throwing that hook and putting it exactly where he needed to go. All right, what a round it was for him. A lot of head kicks landed, scrambled eggs on the other side. We'll see if he can recover. He does a great job of hiding it. He gives you no tell. He doesn't show you when he's coming. That's why those kicks have continued to land, even though he's done it multiple times. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Just missed on the front kick there. Beautiful punch. Real quick leg kick. As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll suddenly he'll change his stance. Big kick lands. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Great job landing that punch. Way to hide that leg kick. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Oh, good job defensively to block the strike there by Lee. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Big punch land. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to go forward. He's got to just throw everything at his opponent to try and find that punch or that kick that's going to end the fight. There is no time for strategy anymore. Big punch land. Able to check the high kick. Let it go now. Just misses with the right. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Two minutes now to go in the fight. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. It almost looked like he went lift there for a second. It's nice head kick. Knee to the body, just what he needed there. Nice head kick. Come on, bud. Let's get those hands working now. Secure that takedown and win the round. Less 
than a minute now to go in the fight. Just missed with the left there. Ooh, what a punch. Seconds remain in the round. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice lead. 20 seconds to go in the fight. Nice leg kick. Nice leg kick. His opponent tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. He is throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. All right, so the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking. Game. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. All right, the official decision is in. It resides with the venerable Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50-45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score. Whereas his opponent had a few moments, he was the one that truly did lead all the interactions. He's the person that truly did dictate if the fight was